Well, the walks to end Alzheimer's have begun in the tri-state, so now's a good time to discuss the many needs and challenges of those who struggle with Alzheimer's and those who love them. Allie Betts is the Director of Marketing for Columbia Healthcare, and she's here to tell us about Augusta's Cottage. Good to see you, Allie. Good to see you, Angie. Tell everybody what the cottage is. So our Augusta's Cottage is our memory care community. Um, a lot of our facilities have those. Uh, it's where we take care of people specialized with dementia or Alzheimer's. Um, we do certain things back there specializing in care for them. It is everything to make sure they're comfortable and they're able to live their life back there and in a good setting. Well, let's talk about a typical day for your in-house residents. Okay. A typical day would be, um, we do have activities. They change about every 30 minutes. Um, so it's called our Meaningful Day Program. So they are doing things that keep them active and are to their likes, but it's keeping them on a routine also. Um, we do everything from baking cookies to making jewelry to doing whatever back there. Um, we do have a good time. And then we do exercise and things like that. Just keeping that day full, mm -hmm. but as you said, the routine is so important. Routine. Why is that so important? Because um, it's easier for people with dementia or Alzheimer's to have a routine. It keeps them calm and it just gives them something to kind of go with during the day. Routine's always better back there. Well, now I know that uh, Columbia Healthcare is part of American Senior Communities. Correct. Do you have other uh, dementia, Alzheimer's units in other places? Yes, other facilities do have them. Uh, North Park and Cypress Grove down here do have them, and also Mount Vernon. What about folks who don't live in your residence but need the services that you have? Right. So we'd be happy to talk to them at any time and have them come in and see us and see our memory care unit and talk to us. So. Can we be connected to you when we're not there? Do you have a program for people that want to be part of this program? So we do. We have what we call Cottage Connections. Um, at Columbia, we have it the third Wednesday of each month, and it's from 5 to 6 p.m., and we kind of just go over different things. We have topics that we go over and things that families and they can help relate to with each other or talk to us about, and we can kind of help them through it. Is that helping the caregivers understand yes. what they're dealing mm -hmm. with and the yeah. progression so of the disease? So we're hoping for families, caregivers, and everything, it just kind of makes life easier for them and helps them understand better. So. For folks who are watching that might think, of, you know, this is uh, my loved one needs to be in this residence, what, what's the best way to, to come and tour and meet you and, and find out what's available to them in the greater American Senior Community? Yeah, absolutely. Come by any time. We're located at 621 West Columbia Street in Evansville, or you can call the facility and schedule a tour with us at 812-428. Five, six, seven, eight. And, and if people want to find out more about all the services you mm -hmm. offer, do you have a website or a Facebook page that we can send our, 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 our audience to? <laughs> we do. Um, Columbia Healthcare does have their own Facebook page. And then we also have um, ASCCare.com where you can go on and check out all the communities through the state of Indiana. Wonderful us. opportunity to see it up close and personal and Absolutely. see how, what that day is like. And it's such a big help to the family. I yes. know you see the results of that every day. Yes. Well, thank you for being here, Allie. No problem. Thank you for having me. It's Andy. always a pleasure. Yes. American Senior Community Serving the Tri-State. And when we come back, we're going to meet some very compassionate high school students. This portion of Lifestyles is brought to you by American Senior Communities.